guys, welcome back. Th as you can see, this is the battleship game I've been working on. Uh, it has 20 inputs, which equals 100 outputs for the display panels. Um, the, they're not hooked up completely yet. I have a few more to do. <laughs> uh, actually, a lot more to do. Because all these torches are supposed to be off, and they're currently on, except for these bottom part, which we have hooked up. The letters are on the side, just like normal battleship. It's a full-size battleship full scale there's the ABC's through H or through J sorry it's the levers and then the 1 through 10 are your buttons now when you would restore your boats I don't have the memory hooked up currently but this will work as the concept when you restore store your boats if you have a three boat and you press uh, any letter you want to have it will go up and down so I'll press 9, which that should automatically store it vertically like that. Now if you were wanting just on the row J, you'd actually have to manually manually put those in, which would be 6, 5, 4, and 3, which would be a 4 boat, and those automatically pop up there. Now when you fire and you're trying to destroy someone else's boat, basically you're going to press you're going to pull down lever H or whichever lever you choose and I'm going to press 4 what that does is it sends just one signal to that location so it would be H4 now how I did that is I made a memory decoder and it's actually fairly simple um, these will be your levers up here this is your J which is your goes to your J panel and it has 10 lines which uh, depending on which button you press here and which if these are down or not depends on what your output is and this right here is your team switcher um, it'll determine if you've pressed the button down here or not and it'll switch the I'll actually have the team switcher and it'll switch it from you be able to fire to not being able to file fire by picking up these pistons. Now to reduce lag, since it does send signal through both of these, I actually inputted these here. And what that does is as soon as you store your memory and you actually turn this on down here, that's gonna pull up these levers or these pistons here and then pull down these pistons, allowing the signal not to be sent through which also makes it so you cannot change the boats that you put into your memory um, there will be more updates on this and I'm planning on doing a lot more videos especially when it's completed uh, if you like the design down here actually DM Mufasa or DM Safu he's my friend on Xbox he actually designed this down here and put my face on it I thought it was actually pretty cool and uh, there will be more videos out here pretty soon. Just check them out. I hope you like it. Please like and subscribe. <laughs>